Ooh, I thought I lost my boy Zab Super Judah, man. Listen, people, you rocking with your boy CBT first. Let me just shout out everybody who came to the page on my last video talking about Zab, man. I know there's a lot of Zab Super Judah fans out there, man. Yeah, we love the past. We love what Zab brought to the table, man. Look, man, he's good, man. You know, many reports was out. That he was in a coma, he had brain uh, swelling on the brain, blood on the brain, different things of this nature, man. But at the end of the day, he good money, he wavy, as you can see in the picture, man. He with his kids, you know, but he talking like he want to get back in the ring. You know, he didn't like the stoppage versus Hammer. I would just say that's just the boxing spirit in Zad, man. And, and you know, he needs that bread too, man. But, like, we got old rappers out there still trying to put up hits, right? They still, you know, trying to make a name for themselves because they was once hot. So, it's just what they know how to do and we gotta respect that man but in boxing it's a dirty sport man Adonis Stevenson now Zab I mean you know even my boy Anthony Joshua got hit to the head and he said he don't remember anything you know after that shot so you know head trauma is real man and you know we don't got time for, to lose any of our boxes lower level to the top tier you see what i'm saying because we love boxing and we want to see the guys get in the ring and face each other and then leave and go home to their families man but my boy zab is good money you what you got my bad boy yeah so and um yeah, so, and, and that's what it is, man, you know, Zab is my guy, man, he wavy, he good, I just hope that he retires, I understand he need the bread, man, but I think he should commentate or train, I think he'd be a great trainer, show somebody how to shoot the one-two and, and, and do some different things in the ring, he got a wealth of knowledge in him, man, you dig what I'm saying, a lot of dudes on YouTube and showing Zab love, and I respect that, you know, even my enemies, <laughs> my YouTube enemies, right, <laughs> you dig, how you gonna be, I don't even know these cocksuckers, but you dig, like, I respect that because that lets me know that they not just in it to just, you know, milk the fans. They actually care about fighters. You dig what I'm saying? And I'm and I got love for, for Zab, man. And uh if anybody gonna be biased, if I'm biased about anything when it comes to boxing, I will be biased with Zab versus whoever. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? And I haven't gonna lie to you, man. Cause he's just my favorite fighter, man. Like I said before, man, Mike Tyson, you know, he he intrigued me. I was intrigued to watch boxing from Mike, but Zab Super Judah made me become a boxer, made me want to get in the ring, made me want to learn how to shoot the one, how to shoot the two, how to use my defense, how to use my feet, how to go to the body. I was intrigued when I seen Zab, man, and I smiled work. I had some fights, you dig? And um, I was putting hands and feet, and I always tell dudes, man, like, you know, like, I was doing things in the street, as far as the street fight, that it would, it just came natural to me. But when I seen Zab in the ring, I'm like, oh, it's a little dude from BK. You know what I mean? I'm watching this fight, so I'm like, yeah, I could do some of that. So I go to um, the BRC. You know, if y'all from NY, y'all from Brooklyn, y'all know what the BRC is. You dig what I'm saying? And this trainer just took me in. He was like, yo, man. He was showing me how to shoot the one, shoot the two, go to the body. He was like, yo. He liked it what I was bringing to the table because I was like a natural. But it, I was watching Zab. Like, Zab was doing things. And I was, I was doing things like that in the streets. And I remember. And I'll never forget going to the body on these dudes in the street, man. Like, I would, I would faint up top and go to the body and... And then, like, I would use the an angle and hit them on a the side of their side of their hip or or near the back of their back. And I used to drop dudes or have dudes hurt or have dudes bring their hands down. And I go back up top, and I was just like, "Oh wow!" It was something new, like riding a bike. And I was like, "Yo, that's crazy!" Like, you know, how come nobody in the streets is doing it like this? They just want to give headshots, headshots. Now remember, stamina, 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 feints and angles will win you a street fight. You dig what I'm saying? And you know, at the end of the day, that's my boy Zad, man. Look, if he want to get back in the ring, it is what it is. You dig? But he understands the consequences. Obviously, he's sitting in, he's sitting in the hospital right now. That's the consequences. You know, I just wish, you know, the zone, Eddie Hearn, see what type of uh power well earning power that zab has because 
He might not be the fighter that we know him as, but he brings and he put asses in the seats. People are going to watch. People are going to be intrigued, especially if you're going to put it in the Barclays Center, man. But you could go anywhere in the world. You dig what I'm saying? As far as the 50 states is all I know. And Zab is going to sell some tickets for you, man. Put them on the undercard, man, because I'm telling you, styles make fights. You see what I'm saying? Zab definitely trained hard for this fight. Zab was definitely in the spa, in the gym sparring with dudes, laying dudes out. I heard, and I, you know what I mean? Like dudes were saying online, and dudes that I know was like, yo, Zab in the building. He doing his thing. He looking good. That's how I was like, yeah, okay. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, sometimes you can look good in sparring, but when you in the real match, things don't look the same. Things aren't the same, man. But I would love to see Zab fight two fights. And everybody in my comment section in my last video, I was reading them like, yeah, you know what? These guys feel the same way I feel, man. Brona versus Zab and Zab versus Regis Progress, man. That's the fight to see, man. I'm telling you, Styles make fights, man. You know, Regis Progress is a great fighter, power puncher. But Zab, based on what he did against Hammer, he still shoot the one. He still got good feet. He still got uh, a good one, too. He, he's in it to win it. But his stamina is a little bit suspect. And he's still susceptible to getting hit over the top with the right. And Regis Progress got power. Only way, in my opinion, Progress will beat Zab is by knockout. But if it goes 12 rounds, I got Zab winning that fight. I don't care what happened versus Hamlet. Yeah, oh yeah, I'm biased. But put your money on the wood, being that I'm biased. Take my biased dollar. You dig what I'm saying? It spins the same. You dig me? But and then Brona, that's a money fight, man. Why can't these guys, these promoters, see it? It's a money fight, man. A B Brona. Everybody looked at Brona as a um, you know, the 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 next Zab in in the respects of. How Zab career went from high to low. Brona career went from high to low. The antics outside the ring. You know, boxing and entertaining hip-hop go hand in hand. If you didn't know that, you've been sleeping under a rock. And that's what Zab brought to the table. He brought it to the table way better than you got. Yeah, Floyd did. Floyd couldn't cross over like that. Floyd had the money. Floyd was talking a little bit flashy. But it was like that South. It was like that Detroit. We don't got time. Listen, when we bring that New York flavor, to these things. You dig what I'm saying? When we put that New York thing together, man, I haven't been going to do it because I know a lot of you cash from different parts of the states and the world and I don't want to... I'm just, I'm from NY. I'm representing NY, man. I'm just telling you how we do things, how we talk, how we move, how we pop our collars. It's a little bit different. You dig me? At the end of the day, man, I would love to have him fight those two guys and you may say what you want. Dad to get killed? Nah, but he wants to fight, man. What you want me to do? So if he going to get in the ring... I'm going to support him. I pay $14.99 to, get, to watch the fight. I watch that on pay-per-view. I watch that. That's my guy. You see what I'm saying? I didn't have to support that card. I don't care what that card was about. I know Zab was headlining. And I want people to realize that Zab got earning potential, earning power at the age he is now. Those two fights with Brona and Progress will put a few million dollars in his pocket. And then after those two fights, he can go ahead and retire. That's what I'm talking about, man. If you really want to be a supporter of the sport, if you really want to be a supporter of black men, we need to support these black men, these black fighters that fell. Yeah, they made mistakes. But a lot of these guys are not about black power and black, you know, excellency and supporting the black dollar and supporting our black fighters. Because this is a fight game, so I'm talking about the fighters. They're not all about that, man. They, they, they talking like they're about that, man. You see what I'm saying? And again... Zab my guy, Zab your guy, let's support him. Go to his Instagram, man, show him some love, man. And at the end of the day, if he decides to get back in the ring, we're going to have to support that too. Because that's our guy, man. You dig what I'm saying? That's how we got to do things, man. At the end of the day, you rocking with your boy CBT, man. I'm on the road. I'm about to get back to the crib. Holla at your boy. Subscribe to the page. We're going to drop some knowledge. We're going to drop some boxing. We're going to drop some breaking news. I got so much to talk about. Who we in nine minutes? Listen, yeah, nah, I'm going to do that because we ain't got enough time for that, man. But like I said, tomorrow, we're going to drop some heat for y'all dudes, man. We're going to Bring a whole new thing to this thing. You dig what I'm talking about? How like oh, your yeah. boy? <laughs> yeah. New media, new perspective. This is what new media look like. This is what new media look like. I
It's all about the house. You box and dogs. Just when you thought it's you had to figure out new media, new perspective, casual box and talk.